Good evening. I'm Erica Abe alongside Marvin Bartlett. After one of the most impressive Sweet 16 victories in NCAA tournament history, UK is just one game away from their fourth Final Four in five years. Kentucky has another quick turnaround. Tomorrow the team will take on Notre Dame. Lee K. Howard is in Cleveland where the Cats are preparing for this next challenge. There was a lot to like in Kentucky's convincing win over West Virginia in the Sweet 16 on Thursday night, but one of the things that stuck out to me was the way that Devin Booker shot the ball. He had been in somewhat of a shooting slump, but on Thursday night, he was 5 of 8 for 12 points, and it appears the slump is over. I feel like it is. You know, I, once I see one go down, I felt like that was good for me. It's very important because it opens up everybody for everything for everybody else. Um, you know, when he's knocking down shots, especially in zones and stuff like that, you know, they can't double our bigs. And it's just, you know, once he's playing so well, uh, we're going to be really hard to stop. I guess really important, you know, considering, you know, we have to throw it to our bigs a lot. And, you know, teams can double our bigs. So, you know, just free up space for our bigs. It will be very important for Devin Booker to shoot the ball well, along with Aaron Harrison, Tyler Eulis, and Andrew Harrison. The Notre Dame Fighting Irish, that's exactly what they do. They try to spread the court and shoot the three ball. The game, well, it's another late night tip, 849 here at the Q in Cleveland. I'm Lee K. Howard for the Fox 56 10 o'clock news.